What's up YouTube? Jeff back again from high on Android at DopeTechDaily.com and today I've got the iPhone 6s and I'm going to take a look at a new case for the iPhone 6s. You guys saw me do the unboxing. This is actually my fiance's phone. This is the rose gold iPhone 6s. She's visiting so I finally got a chance to sort of get it out of the plastic. She's been playing around with it. So I'm going to do a few case reviews for it. Today I've got the Ozaki case here for the iPhone 6 and the 6s. This is the 0.3 millimeter, four grams, super light case. Uh, and this is the jelly case from Ozaki. You can see there a couple of the things, a couple of the features of the case. You've got the TPP formula. You've got this gap-free design. And you can see here, you've got a bonus, two free screen protectors that they're gonna include in the packaging for you. Now you guys saw me do the wood case from Ozaki. That one was also super slim. So this one's kind of similar, but this is the jelly color. Uh, the jelly variant and you can see here up top they've got all these different colors of the jelly case uh, you can see here that i've got the black variant here they sent me this case out for review so i want to give a shout out to ozaki these are all the colors that you can find on amazon so if you're interested in this case after the video uh, you can hit the link in the description i'll throw the link down there and you can check it out so let's go ahead and get this case unboxed now there's a little bit of tape on their cases on the sides so let me go ahead and get the unboxing knife and we can go ahead and get this unboxed. So we've got a little bit of tape here on the sides and you can just slice that, pop it open. And as you guys saw with the wood case, very simple packaging. And then if you slide out the materials on the inside here, you guys will see they have a few extra goodies for you that I mentioned on the outside of the packaging. So let's just go ahead and take a quick look at that. Of course, they've got your installation guide right here. You guys can see, go ahead and install the protective case first, clean the LCD, and then you go ahead and include the dust removal sticker, and then you can put on your screen protector. And then of course, you can see over here, to avoid scratching the case interior, you install the top two corners first by aligning the iPhone camera lens with the case lens cutout. So you can go ahead and slide that in, and the case will slide in perfectly. And then you can install the screen protector so you can see here, they did include a couple screen protectors for you. So you can see here, you've got both a black and a white option, depending on which of the iPhones that you have. So this gives you sort of the full cutout coverage. So it's gonna cover your whole front screen. And so on the white one, obviously, this is gonna cover up the home button, home button there, we'll go around it, you gotta cut out so you can still use your Touch ID. Definitely nice of Ozaki to give you that. You've got your dust removal sticker, the alcohol prep pad and everything you need to install that. And then they've also got a refer a friend bonus card here. So you can um, refer a friend and you can earn some rewards. And then lastly, they also have uh, a few things about different ways to style your iPhone. So you can check out more from Ozaki. Again, I'll drop the link below in the description. So let's go ahead and get into putting the case on the phone and the plastic insert. Now this is a super thin case. Uh, so if you really wanna maintain the thinness of your iPhone 6S, you guys know this is a thin, sleek looking phone and you still wanna retain some of that form factor, this is definitely a case for you. So let's go ahead and take a quick look around. You can see here there's some Ozaki branding on the bottom. This is the black one, but it's sort of got like a frost look to it because you're still gonna be able to sort of see a little bit through. You guys can see the white of my table there. We got cutouts over here, of course, for your volume up and down, the mute switch, cut out here for the power, cut out here for your camera. And then on the bottom, you can see it's just sort of left exposed where the charging port and the speaker will be. That way you'll be able to access to those ports as well. So again, the, the sort of sell of this case is it's super thin. So if we go ahead and just slide it on, and get the phone right in there, you can see we barely added any bulk at all to the iPhone. So you can see, you can still see the Apple logo through the back, which is another big selling point of this case, at least in my opinion. A lot of people who get the iPhone, they wanna show off the Apple logo, there it is. You can still see some of the color of your iPhone because you got the rose gold peeking through here on the camera cutout. Of course, you can also see the rose gold exposed here on the bottom, like I said, the speaker and your lightning port, your headphone jack, that's all exposed. And then around the sides, again, you got the cutouts. So you can see there, we got the power button there, still works fine. And then also we got the access to the volume buttons, which we can also access fine as well as the mute switch here 
all of them have easy access. So overall, again, this case is just amazingly light. I think the one thing you'll notice when you get this case is how light and thin it really is. It feels kind of fragile, but you're definitely gonna get that light and sort of thin texture that retains the uh, feel of your iPhone. Also, you're gonna get a nice grip. So this is not a nice grippy material. It's matte, so it's not gonna get fingerprints, not a glossy finish. You're definitely gonna add some grip because the iPhone is a little slippy and slippery in the hand. So if you're looking to get some grip on your phone, but you don't wanna add to the bulk, add to weight, you know, make the phone look really, really uh, big and bulky like an OtterBox or some of these other cases, this is definitely a way to go. Now, of course, in the way of protection, is this really gonna give you maximum protection? Of course not. You can see again, there is a minimal lip around the front. So if you sit your phone face down, you are gonna have a little lip, so it's not gonna scratch your screen, but this is a very, very minimal lip to keep from adding to the bulk. So yes, if you drop your phone down like this, it's gonna get the bottom because it's exposed. So of course, this is not a maximum protection case. This is really for someone who wants to have something on the back so it doesn't catch scratches and also something to give you a better grip so you don't drop it. So obviously you'll want to throw a tempered glass screen protector on here. Uh, I did the tempered glass screen protectors from iLoom and I'll have some more of those coming up as well for your iPhone 6S and 6S Plus. All right guys, so again, this is the Ozaki Jelly Case. Comes in a variety of colors. I'll drop the link down below in the description if you guys want to check it out on Amazon. I appreciate them sending me out the case. You guys can follow me on Twitter and Google+. My links are in the description. You can check out news.highonandroid.com as well as dopetechdaily.com for more great Android news and tech giveaways. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.